Hey, it's Friday. Aren't you excited? It's time for the studio update. Got tattoos of the week, the latest on body piercing and content news, and ooh, shiny thing from Shannon. Coming up right now, starting with uh, Brent with his tattoo of the week. Hello, interwebs. It's time for the tattoos of the week. And um, yeah, I meant to show this uh, tattoo a couple weeks back, and it just kind of fell to the wayside. And well, here it is. Um, so this uh, tattoo is of Jesus, and he is uh, holding a chain, uh, breaking the chains of uh, whatever kind of chains you want to break. Uh, they don't have to be, you know, symbolic chains. They could just be dog chains, whatever. Uh, but yeah, he's sitting there holding that chain and, uh, you know, looking up for uh, uh, hope, in hope, I don't know, in pain maybe. Uh, I'm going in the wrong direction with this anyway, but, uh, yeah, it, it, black and gray, uh, soft shading here and there. Uh, the young gentleman that came in to, uh, you know, get this tattoo, he pretty much drew this up and, uh, we just kind of ran with his drawing and voila, here we have inner bicep tattoo, black and gray, and it took uh, about uh, six hours, I think in all, but yeah. Lots of fun to work on, and I thank you for checking it out. Bye, guys. Davo here with the Body Beer Second Conda News. And oh, shiny thing of the week. Uh, let's see. Uh, news wise, not a lot to say. I, Jimmy, if you hadn't noticed, is missing. It's because he's on a much uh, deserved vacation. Hope he's having fun down there in uh, the uh, southern parts of the United States. And getting a lot of relaxation in. So you can come back and hit it again. And tattoo ya. Um, right now, uh, fairly busy. Had an extremely busy week last week. Uh, it's one of the reasons why I didn't get as much content up. It's one of the reasons why I'm out of a lot of things. So, I, you can walk in whenever uh, we are open and have time available. We'll be happy to pierce you. However, it's always a good idea to have an appointment. And to set up an appointment, go to axiompiercing.com slash booking, and it'll take you through the process. If you are wanting to get tattooed, you need an appointment. I uh, To start that process, send us an email at shop at skinkitchen.com or give us a call at 515 255 4430. Now here's uh, Shannon with her pick for this week for Ooh, Shiny Thing. Hello, everyone. It's Shannon with Axiom Body Piercing. I'm going to go over this week's Ooh, Shiny Thing. So, because it's nice out, I'm thinking flowers. So, this week I chose this awesome three cubic zirconium rose flower threadless end that we have. It is titanium and it has the white cubic zirconium gems. Um, I'd love to see this pretty much anywhere. Um, upper ear cartilages, of course, and then lobes would be my favorite. So definitely come on in. We do have some other floral pieces that I'd love to see some other people rock. So we'll see you soon. And until next time, stay cool. Thank you, Shannon. Uh, good pick. Now it's time for what we like to call content news. You know, they're bringing Futurama back, I guess, supposedly. I'm looking forward to it. <sighs> Maybe new material. Got up four videos this week, starting with the studio update, same thing as this one, but last week with different tattoos and different news and different stuff. So you missed it, go back and watch it. Now. Well, after you've gotten done watching this one. Then on Saturday, post the latest episode of Piercing, or Consultations by a Piercer, this one I covered spider bites. You know, the lip piercings on one side or the other, where there's two or more of them. Usually two. If you're thinking about getting that done and have questions about it, the video is a good place to start. It pretty much lets you know everything you should probably know before getting it done. Then on Sunday, post the latest episode of Q&A in the Kitchen, our podcast. This was the video edition. We talked about projects, piercing and tattoo projects, and how long they take and what they involve in some of the things that you should expect if you start a large project. Very in-depth, good video if you're planning on starting a sleeve or an upper ear piercing project or a, a set of genital piercings or what have you. It's a good video to watch to give your expectations of how long it's going to take and maybe planning that out for your future endeavors. 
Then, uh, yesterday, as in Thursday, post the latest episode of Piercing Top 5. This one I covered, the top five things to avoid when buying body piercing jewelry. And the short version went out, too. It's just a list. If you'd like to see this video or these videos or any of these other videos or any of our other videos, check out our channel. Link is in the description. Also, uh, while you're there, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you're notified all the time of when we post videos so you never miss one. Wouldn't that be fantastic? Also, like, uh, share, and spread the news. The good news. Now here's Jack with his Tattoo of the Week. Hello, you crazy tattoo kids. It's Jack at Skin Kitchen Tattoo, and I'm going to show you a tattoo I did. Uh, this was four-ish settings, I believe. Um, I think they were probably four or five hours a piece, so there's maybe around 20-ish, give or take, hours in this. But anyway, uh, the Jeebus in the middle was brought in, and we I went pretty true to the artwork for the most part, but the uh, surrounding was just free-handed on there. We did, uh, let's see, it would be his left side first, and then uh, in the picture, I had just finished the right side and kind of bringing it all together. So that's why it looks a little bit uneven. We'll go with that word. So, yeah, uh, it hasn't, uh, it's part of it's healed and part of it's not. So, but it is uh, finished. So I thought you might want to check it out, you know, because you're on a, watching a tattoo vid. So that, you know, do the math on that. Long form, of course, show your work. And, uh, yeah, there it is. So, um, all black and gray, no whites or nothing. Like I said, middle part was stenciled and the other part was just freehanded drawn on to kind of fit in and finish her off. So I hope you liked checking it out. If you did tell everybody, you know, and say, check this out. It's pretty cool. Or if you don't like it, then just forget about it and, uh, watch some TV. Don't get sunburned. We'll see you next week. Well, that's it. I'm done. I'm out of here till next week. Here's no video of tattoos and piercing still with ease and without a single issue. And if you're in the Des Moines, Iowa area, we all would love to see if you're tattooing and body piercing needs in the future. Man, I'm going to go get some air conditioners. Condition that air and, and, and cool down. Stay out of sealed rooms. <laughs>